Great day, children. Welcome back to our online classes. Hope you've had lunch. Beautiful. Yes, this is our computer studies class. And it's for prep diamond. And our topic this morning is the keyboard. Everybody repeat after me the keyboard again the keyboard and how many of us have seen a keyboard before yes we all have seen a keyboard on our phones on our parents phones there is keyboard our systems that is our laptops has a keyboard our desktop at home has an external keyboard now what's a keyboard a keyboard has keys on it is a board that has keys on it very simple is a board that has what keys on it you can even make your own keyboards yes you can get a board a cardboard and get you know buttons you can construct buttons with cartons, with papers, and write numbers and alphabets on it to form your own keyboard. By pressing the keys, you can type alphabets and numbers. You can write your name. You can write anything by just pressing on the keys. Keyboard acts like a pen as it helps us to write on the screen. Yes. Just like your phones, your parents' phone, your tablets, your laptops, your computer set at home. Keyboard is just like the pencil you use. The pen you use, it helps you to write on the screen. You can't take a pen and start writing on your laptop, except if it's a soft touch laptop that has a magic pen for writing. Understood? Yes, a keyboard is a board that has what? Keys. Now, look at all the keys. Each key has something written on it. Identify alphabets A, B, C, and numbers 1, 2, 3. Yes, just look at the next slide. You'll see a keyboard. Can you see that? This is your what? A keyboard. We have our numbers 1 to 0. We have the minus sign, the plus equal sign. We have our alphabets A to Z. And we have other keys, just such as the shift key, the caps lock, the tab, the control, the option, the command. These keys are called what? Special keys. We call them special keys because they don't write alphabet. They have their own functions. They do their own thing. You'll see a very long key that is longer than every key here. It's called the space bar. The space bar. Yes, just like you're writing on your book and you want to give a space, you move your hand a little. So this one, you just press it and it gives a space for you to continue your writing and you see the key delete anything you don't want you can do what delete it anything you don't want you can delete it beautiful now you know what a keyboard is right and you've seen this before good thank you so much and i hope you enjoyed the class see you in our next class Bye bye. I love you and you're the best. Remember that. Bye.